Reaching Rob is back. Yo. The end of the world is coming soon. If for all you Christians out there, if you look in the Bible, everything in Revelation is coming true today, it seems like. It says in the Bible about a the financial elite and the world more the world elite will power will power the world. What do you think the NWO is? The New World Order. Well, there's a thing out there, it's called There's a campground, Bohemian Grove, which is located in Northern California, and I bet you didn't know but every July, for a couple of weeks, like the most powerful people, richest people, CEOs, power for people in government, they meet there, Bohemian Grove. Alex Jones snuck a camera in there and he videotaped it. I'm going to have a link below. It talks about, the Bible talks about storms. Well, we got Isaac and now here's what's pissing me off. The CEOs of these gas companies want to use Isaac as an excuse to raise the gas prices again. Before, a couple of weeks ago, when I, about three weeks ago, I left for Michi Michigan, gas prices were, I was down here in Arizona, gas prices was like, when I left, it was like 3.23 a gallon. I filled up today, 3.61. And even Michigan, it's almost $4 when I was there for a week. It's ridiculous. They want to raise the gas prices, every excuse they can. Now the excuse is Isaac. Did this, they did the same thing right after 9-11. Right after 9-11, everybody panicked and they raised the damn prices to $5 a gallon. I shit you not. Did the same thing with Katrina. It's an excuse. Well, anyway, I believe at the end of the world and Jesus is going to walk in my lifetime. With everything that's going on. So, uh, and now the poison in the food to make everybody stir out. Jesse Ventura did a thing where they want to cut the the world's leaders are gonna conspire together to cut the world's population down to 500 million by poisoning the food. Oh, look at the West Nile virus. It's now an epidemic, allegedly. I just cooked some steak or pork chops, whatever. Is this stuff safe to eat or is it poisoned? Go ahead, make me sterile. Why well, can't have kids? Saves me thousands of dollars in raising brats. Fine, that's fine with me. I don't give a damn. But I gotta be a better Christian. Because Jesus is coming. And I believe it's gonna happen in my lifetime. December 21st, 2012. It also says in the Bible to, about fake prophets and fake dates. I'm gonna throw some Bible verses up to get you atheist people thinking. And I'm gonna put some links down below. Call me crazy. You already do. I don't know what else to say. I'm just in a pissed off mood again at work. Dealing with some idiots last night. Some idiot in my taxi last night was accusing me of credit card fraud. Well, you swiped my credit card twice. I'm like, no, I only swiped it once and it declined your damn credit card. Well, I'm not going to pay you. Okay. So I followed him and I got his damn address. I got your address, asshole and Tempe. Let me see, what's the name of those apartments? Trillium Apartments? Uh, Van Buren Street, 52nd Street, something like that, 56th. I got your address and your information. That's okay, that's okay. He wanted my last name. 
Well, what's your name? What's your cab number? I want your last name. I'm not, I'm not giving you my last name. Are you kidding me? It's all over the internet anyway. Well, this guy refuses me to, to give me his name. I'm not giving you my fucking name. I'm trying to watch my language. I'm trying to be a better Christian. All right, check out my videos. Woodward 2012 video. I'm still trying to get going. I'm going to have it pretty soon. Well, I got some links below. Bohemian Grove, the NWO, you know, Worldwide Conspiracy, Alex Jones. Click the links and find out the truth. Infowars.com. All right. through this night.
creating desolations in the earth. He makes wars cease to the end of the earth. He breaks the bow and cuts the spear in two. He burns the chariot in fire. Be still and know that I am God. I will be exalted among the nations. I will be exalted in the earth.